Well, once again, in typical me fashion, I have joined the server, and it's nighttime, which is always super duper. It actually doesn't matter at all, because I'm doing safe work right now. I don't know how safe it really is, because I've seen a crocodile out there. So you know what? I'm going to actually do something that is safe. Well, it would have been safe had I actually used the ladder. Um, so, did some work. And we have this extending out a little further now than it was before. And I have this side all set up. Uh, it's going to go out further than it is currently. But I had... Oh, dude, there's a shark right there. See? That, that's why this is so perfect, because you can see the animals. And unfortunately, I have that halo selection on. There we go. we got a shark right out the window. And then we run over here. And right above us, we've got a beautiful sea turtle. We've got another shark out there. Who's going to swim around on top of us. Hopefully, these animals won't be able to attack anybody through the obsidian glass really hate to have somebody dying in the zoo because an animal got him through the glass but that's not really the point here I don't know where that guy just went but whatever I had the brilliant idea of putting a viewing area in underneath here so what I'm gonna do I haven't quite solidified this idea yet, so bear with me. I'm going to have to put some kind of a railing in. That is a given, because without a railing, somebody's going to walk off this and die, and there'll be a lawsuit, and I ain't got time for lawsuits, so we'll have to do some sort of a rail, which I think home decor has some railings I can use. So you'll go down here, and probably here. Oh wait, I may have messed that up. No, I'm still okay. I have to go on the outside and put the obsidian glass in first. But I want to wait for daylight to do that, because it's just going to be safer. Eventually I'll do something better for lighting, but temporary for right now for construction purposes those torches will suit just fine okay so we're doing I think that's right because that's underneath the stair I should get rid of that dirt and place some stone oh come so we'll have this it'll actually be one note further forward than this so you'll be able to see yeah the animals right out in the water there I'm gonna remove this just because I want to harvest all of these resources. And yeah, that one I don't think I... No, wait. I can remove that. I just can't go further than that. So I just let the water in. Um, so, morning's coming it looks like. I hope I just do this right. Okay, sharks seem to be gone. Alrighty. So the big trick of this is just the bulk removal of material. And the only reason it's a trick is because you're dealing with air limitations. I need to breathe or I'll die. Glad those sharks are not hanging out. That is excellent. Okay. There's one in from the stairs, so it should be these two. And then going across. And I think to there. Let me get some breath here. So it looks like I'm doing one, two, three. No, two. Two nodes. And two notes. Okay. Wah! Crocodile attack. Wow, he really wants to eat me. Someplace. Ah! Never mind. I was going to get someplace he couldn't reach me, but 
clearly could. It's all right, though. We survived the alligator attack. And just chuck a bunch of glass in here. One of the things I got to do is figure out how I'm putting all these super glow glass bits in. Which I don't even know if I have any on me right now. Oh, shark. Super. I don't think he spotted me yet, though. Super glow glass. I have one piece of super glow glass. Well, it's going to work. I should probably actually put it in a little bit closer. I don't know. Uh, let's see here. If, yep, if everything went to plan, which it looks like I calculated this all right. Perfect. I do dislike the fact that I have coal sitting there. I'll probably eventually pull that coal out. This water will at some point fix itself. I don't know exactly when or how, but I recall the front side here was like that before, and obviously it is no longer, so it has fixed itself. So I'm assuming that will fix itself as well. So that's all good, which is dandy. Uh, the other thing I need to do here is check the mailbox. Nothing. Which is perfectly a-okay. I got tons of tons of things to do that don't require that. Um Yeah. The garden's fine to leave as is. I think what I really need to do here is get those rails for those stairs. There's a few different styles and options. I just got to figure out which style and option ah, I want to go with and craft them, which I can never remember. Are they just called railings? I don't think so. I think there is a different name for them, but I don't know what. Um, I'm just going to try rail. I don't think that's right. Yeah, it just gives me... Um, what would you call those? Handrail? No, because that would have pulled up under rail. Um, banisters. That's what they're called. Raw iron. Looks fancy, but that's expensive. Whoa. Whoa. White dye and brown dye? Yeah, I don't have that. I'm not fancy like that. I'm just going to have to do some group wood and sticks. Which I think I have. So we should be okay there. I've got the sticks on me. Wood stuff. So here we go. Um, I guess we'll grab those. Because why not? If that makes two... Wait, is there any other options? I'm going to have to put a rail at the top too. It would be cool to see something that matches. I don't think there's going to be anything that... It's going to work with that. Doesn't look like it. I'll probably have to do... Well, I could do these iron bars. I think. Well, whatever. We'll figure out what this looks like. I'll just start with one, I guess. And then I'll just manually double it. Cause I think four is going to be enough. And if not, well, we make more. No biggie. These, from what I recall, they automatically do the angle. You just have to put them onto the right side, which I don't know what side that is. Um, that guy's probably coming in. Yep, I just ran into a dead end. That was genius. Ha! <laughs> he died anyways. Good. Okay, the trick was... I don't know what it was. Yeah, I don't really want a railing going that direction. It's kind of silly to have. Um, I can't place it there because I'm in that node. Well, that's weird. Why no. tell? Is there no end to the silliness? That might actually work, though. 
because you can't fall that way till you get to the bottom stair and at that point you could be walking off the stair to get here anyway I think that works oh that okay that's why that's not working which makes sense why couldn't it just stay straight that would at least work oh well I'll I'll figure something out for there really <laughs> you're gonna do that it's gonna stay straight where it's supposed to be angled are you kidding me why would it do that there we go well that's weird hmm so I guess I need to do the fence which isn't a huge deal um um whoa 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 whoa, whoa. picket fence okay I don't know what's going on here a little bit of leg um here we go yeah how do I make that oh that's expensive I'm a poor man I can't afford this expensive stuff bunch of sticks I can afford that six of them it's way more than I need but it'll work there we go now you can't fall there and you can get round into here see out to there though all you really see is a wall of stone and dirt so time to go back out into the <laughs> ferociously fun underwater and mine this stuff out of here yep this is where world edit would be like the absolute best thing to have of course world edit is a not on the server and if it were I would not have access to it because I am not an admin and I don't think I know of a single server that just gives out world edit to their normal players like that's just super dangerous you can grieve so much so badly so quickly with world edit that you would you'd have to be a really bad server admin to just let everybody use that because you can, you can do so much stuff with it it's a very very powerful mod like it's it's really nice once you learn it because you can do stuff like this you do the two corners and just say fill with water boom it's done everything's removed you want the bottom of it all filled with stone or sand or whatever you select the two corners tell it what to fill with boom it's finished you're done it's the absolute best tool ever for building large-scale things but in the hands of a griefer it is your worst nightmare because they will wreck so much stuff like, you just make a giant square in the sky and then have it place lava and suddenly you have this giant wall of flowing lava everywhere and it's burned stuff assuming you have fire they use it to grief with water it's it's sad that people are like that honestly that they would want to ruin people's things but as we all know i even experienced it here people stealing my stuff because they're too lazy to go get it themselves or they're just so dumb that they think that i'm giving my things away because it happened to not be in a locked chest which obviously was not the case just happened to overlook making the one chest locked which admittedly was my fault but still it doesn't give them the right to go steal things but whatever preaching to the choir here i know my viewers would never ever do that right leave in the comments below if you would that way every server admin can just ban you as soon as you join or something i don't know not that anybody uses their YouTube name as their name on a server. I wouldn't imagine they do anyway. Can I make it? No, I don't think I can. I will die first. And evidently I'm out of space to hold more stuff, so I need to go back <sighs> inside anyways. Okay, this... That just needs to be completely rethought. 
the whole method and system for getting around here. I need something better. Trouble is, I don't want other people using it to go places where they shouldn't be going. Which makes it tricky because then you're really limited on where you can put things. Like, yeah, I could put travel nets in, but as soon as I put a travel net that you can get to any place outside, well, now anybody can use it to get inside of here and stuff, which I don't want. So it becomes the um, Achilles heel, I think is the phrase. And I don't want Achilles heels. He can keep his own heel. I got my own heels already. I don't need his. And I'm not talking about high-heeled shoes here, people. I'm talking about my feet. Uh, I'll throw the tin in there. Miscellaneous stuff, I will throw that in there. I think I have string in here already. Super glow glass, I did need that. I don't need that. I don't need that particularly. Uh, the rotten meat, I think I actually have. Yep. I don't know why. I think there's some animal that eats it, actually. Pretty sure. I could be wrong on that. More obsidian glass. Good. A ton of that. Actually, let me take two coal lumps. I'm going to go ahead and make two torches quick. Uh, well, two stacks, whatever. Um, and actually, the reason I came here in the first place was to eat something. And then I like completely forgot that's why I came here. Though I admittedly did have to clear my inventory out because I was full of things. Okay, I got super glow glass. I'm going to go throw that in that hole I dug real quick. And call this a video. Going to be a little on the shorter side, but I don't think people are going to mind. I honestly don't. I think 40 minute videos are too long. I don't know if I've done a 40 minute long video yet, but... Oh, a little baby shark. But I definitely don't want to do 40 minute videos. So, I will keep them shorter. Or that's my goal anyways. See how well it actually works. Uh, I'll be doing some more of the, the digging and excavating down there off camera. Um, yeah, I'm just going to make a big square underground. That's a tunnel that you can walk through. And you'll be able to look at the animals from the sides. and It should actually be pretty cool, I think. When I get uh, when I get it all done. So, yeah. Um, I'll catch you guys next time.